Welcome back to another introduction video. <laughs> so for this video, I decided to look at the group Rocking Dolls. And this is the first time I've actually heard of them. And it's quite surprising. They have a pretty cool concept. Uh, for Rocking Doll, they are under uh, SRP Entertainment. They are a girl group and they have four members, which are Roa, Ari, Juri, and Vina. Uh, they debuted December 19th and 20 in 2021, which was uh, almost a year ago. They're almost reaching uh, meeting their uh, one year debut. And, uh, uh, they're, they're almost reaching their one year debut anniversary. Okay, so let's just go to look at each member and see who's who. <laughs> okay, so members. So Roa. Okay, so her n birth name is Kim Hayden. Hayden. Uh, she's born June 19th, 20, 2002. Wow, she's young. <laughs> they, okay, well, of course, to me, they're young, really young, but yeah. Okay, so she's Korean and she's a Gemini. And she's 165 centimeters, which is 5 feet and 5 inches, which is pretty tall. Okay, her MBTI personality type is IST, uh, no, sorry, ISFP, so she's an introvert. Her unexpected charm is that she's different from fierce face and pure mind. Uh, I, I think I need to take out my tongue and get a new one because I think... I'm, it's not working for me. Okay, I will re-say that. Her, unex uh, her unexpected charm is that she's different from a fierce face, pure mind. Her other charming point is a paw print mole pattern on her face. Ooh, uh, where is it? Oh, I think she covered up uh, in that, I guess, individual photo. Uh, she'd remove her moles for 100 million won. She's good at imitating voices. She likes spicy foods such as super spicy chicken legs. Dang! Okay, I, I'm i not good with spicy food, but spicy food is pretty good. She likes ballad songs. Uh, she enjoys Oh My Girl's bright concept. She likes walking alone. She likes mint chocolate. Dang, a lot of- I like mint chocolate. Is it mint chocolate or is it mint chocolate ice cream? <laughs> uh, <laughs> She's said to have a great cheerful side. She says that in 10 years, she'll be a multi-tainer and... Hmm? Does that mean she's like singer, uh, dancer, and rapper? Leader? Like that? And will engage in, engage in numerous activities. She'll also be a CEO. We like girl queens that have high goals, yes. The best barista and will be sort of a wiki guide for tasty restaurants. <laughs> I like her. Her role model is 2 p.m.'s Juno. That was Roa. Now with Juri. Wait, is that Juri? For, for some reason, I thought of um, Jurina. I, she's in Rocket Punch. Wrong girl, wrong girl. Okay, Juri. Her birth name is Lee Juri. She was born October 27th, 2003. Ooh, another young one. And her zodiac sign is Scorpio. And she's Korean. She has a pet dog named Mei. Her MBTI personality type is ESFP. She's an extrovert. Her charming points are the mole under her eyes and her lips. Oh, I think the makeup covered it, but... Dang. One of her main specialties is dancing. She doesn't like mint chocolate. Oh no, her and Roa are opposites in this case. She says that in 10 years, she'll be a great singer and live a successful life. Her role model is Rosé. Wow, I think she's 19. Yeah, around 19. Ari. Ari. Oh. Uh, her birth name is Mang Hui Su. She's, she was born February 23rd, 2004, 
and she's a Pisces, and she's Korean. Dang, she's young. She's from Cheongnam, Cheong, uh, Cheongcheon, Cheongnam. Screw my pronunciation. I'm so sorry. Uh, according to herself, she and Vina are the most sentimental members. Her MBTI personality type is INFJ. Oh, introvert. Her main specialty is singing. One of her charming points is her mole. Someone tried tried to wipe the mole off, thinking it was food. She believes pink is her life. She likes mint chocolate. She says that in 10 years, she'd like to perform at Coachella. Her role model is G-Dragon. Dang, where's her mole? It's most likely somewhere near her lip. She gives me kind of a Wanyang vibe. Maybe it's because of her makeup. Like, if you cover, only look at her eyes. Like, she, her eyes, it really has Wanyang vibes. Okay, outfit-wise, I'll come on outfits afterwards. Because, haha. <laughs> Okay, Vina. So her birth name is Hong Hyunju. She was born April 11, 2006. And her zodiac sign is Aries. Uh, she's Korean. And she and Ari are the most sentimental members, according to Ari. Her MBTI personality type is ENFP. Oh, an extrovert. So they have two extroverts and two introverts. Her charming point is her lips. She's a person full of energy. She'd like to travel to Japan. She likes loud music and songs with good vibes. Her favorite lip brand is MAC. Her opinion on mint chocolate is 50-50. <laughs> she says that in 10 years she'll be traveling around the world while drinking a cup of coffee. Her role model is Hyanna. On April 1st, 2002, it was announced that she would take it she would be taking a hiatus due to health reasons. Oh no. I hope she is able to uh, get better quickly. Okay, so these girls are pretty young. And as much as I, at first I thought they were a bit older because older groups do mature concepts a bit better. And I'm not sure if this is considered a mature concept or is it Western style concept? Because usually when it's western style, like, like the clothing, like, you know, they always have those boots in western style. Like, if it's going to be like a wild west, they have these fancy boots and then, <laughs> I don't, and like, these kind of dresses, but they don't look like dresses. It's like, open in the front, but it's actually a shirt. Like, how, uh, she has her, like, dress. I'm not really a fan of having them like wear like really you know with younger kids like I don't like having them sexualized until they reach age like when they're of age if this is their choice to wear a bit more revealing clothing it's their choice like I don't know if this is uh, ro like rocking doll members like ideas of like their office or if it was like forced on them because of their stylist and then like their manager CEO like their design like Okay. people like Roa this this outfit is good I like it like yeah she she is like of age but like even though she's of age she, she has a good outfit this outfit's great I really like the vibe it's like giving like sex uh, sexy sorry why why I, why did I not finish the word I'm so sorry like it gives me like the sexy spy vibe I like she's like you know, like Black Widow, how they like land like, eh, like that after dropping down. Well, how she lands, it gives me this, like, I'm Scarlet, not Scarlet Witch, I'm Black Widow. <laughs> like, I'm a, I'm about to kick you up because uh, you stole something that you shouldn't have. You stole <laughs> my heart. I don't know. I, that was a joke. I'm so sorry. I'm not good with jokes. Okay, with Jury, like, yeah. She is of age, like, yeah, it's kind of interesting with her style, like, is this more of a car racing style? Like, I feel like the, with the speed rider, riders, like, is that, like, like, is she, like, a racetrack girl? Like, I don't know what racetrack girls look like, 
like you from what I thought I thought of racetrack girls it's like they, they're at the racetrack and they're what are racetrack girls oh shoot uh, maybe maybe I shouldn't say that maybe like her idea like her clothing style is like racetrack she's wearing clothing that represents speed uh I guess power energy because when the cars are going really fast you feel speed power energy and then wind but i don't think there's a wind aspect of here because it have to have flowing hair for that wind aspect <laughs> i'm so sorry if i said something wrong okay for ari mm, uh, okay like she is kind of um she is kind of in the might be minor age but might be reaching the um actual like uh adult age she gives me a more of a i am strong powerful like i am going to control you like her gaze is like oh, are you sure you want to do that <laughs> like, like come on follow me be good follow me <laughs> like she does have that kind of look like and then the little like rope braid i i think that's like rope in her hair like some kind of like rope tied in her hair. Like it's cute. It's a good uh, pop out aspect. It's just that uh, her shorts are a bit too short. I know those are safety shorts. And usually. And of course in western culture. We've seen like. Like well, like western culture. There's kids. Like kids. They, they wear anything freely. And no judgy. No judgy at all. Like they want to wear whatever they want. Go ahead. It's just that once, like, you're in the entertainment industry, you don't, like, people don't know if they're actually doing it to, uh, I guess, for the adult audience to cash in that money, like, by sexualizing their minors. So that's always the worry I have. And, like, okay. Like, I did like the outfit, but uh, if she was of age, yeah, okay, it, I, I'd be fine with it. Uh don't know if it was her choice or if not like for Vina, we don't really see a full outfit but this outfit does look pretty good it's not too revealing as we've seen like you know sometimes in the sometimes companies want to be like oh these girls are the minors they're mature for their age like yeah they are mature so that means they can wear whatever like you know strange stuff like yeah like uh, the styling is good like it gives her the innocent vibe like she's young because well of course because she is the machina and she is like 16 or younger around 15 16 like she i like it, it's like although she's young it, it's like the fire fire patterns like she's fiery she's like yeah i'm young but i'm fiery if you mess with me I'm gonna fight you, but okay, maybe, maybe she just have the. Uh, you, you you want to fight? I'm going to fight you. Don't mess around with me. <laughs> Cute. Oh, but one thing for sure is of of the members, two of them like mint chocolate, one doesn't, and then one is fifty fifty, <laughs> which is kind of cute. Because mint chocolate chip ice cream. Oh, mint chocolate. It's not ice cream. Mint chocolate is quite good. Okay, time to guess who's who. Ready, set, go. Okay, first one. Roa. Okay, I know for sure. Roa, she... Dun, 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 dun. Um... <laughs> Chiri? Dun, 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 dun. Uh, <gasps> Ari? 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 Wait, oh, one young eyes. One young eyes. I, Ari has one young eyes, so... She's Ari. <laughs> oh, Roa. Um, she has the kind of. Hmm, she gives. I don't know what her eyes remind me of, but she does have the really soft eyes. Uh, is this a Roa? Roa, Ari. Um, but then yeah, uh, yeah. Roa does have a thinner face. Um. Okay, let's see. G. Oh, Chao Yue, Yang Chao Yue, she, is, she was part of Rocket Girls, or the Nine. And she reminds me of one of the members from there. Uh, Rina. Okay, so Rina? 
um, Rina, Yuri, Ichiri, Ari, Roa. And Roa, I think I got it correct. If you know, actually know rocking dolls, and if I messed up, I am so sorry. Um, I'm not good with, okay, faces are a bit easier for me than actual names. I'm so sorry. Hopefully, you got a bit more insight on rocking dolls, and it was actually a bit informative, although, uh, <laughs> I'm not the best at explaining. I'm so sorry, but I hope you like this quick introduction to rocking dolls. And they will be uh, having a comeback on August 15th, and they will release their MV for Grey. And then on the 20th, they will release their MV for I Just Wanna Be With You. And August 22, they'll release Drop Down. And August 23, they'll release Pom Pom. And September 19th, they'll release Survive with the album release. So... If you can't wait for that many releases, if you want to, I mean, uh, if you're ready to wait for those releases, MV releases, stay tuned because they'll be coming out soon. In two days, and then in 17 days, always oh, like a lot, depending on when this comes out, it most likely uh, the first, uh, their first MV, Grave, would have come out. So. And the next MV that will come out soon is I Just Want to Be With You, which is August 20th. Well, thank you so much. Hope you have a great day, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!